Hey everybody, welcome back to the Dominican Route and today we will be talking about another topic. They're just going to ask me a random question and today's date is February 24, 2022. And today's forecast is 84 degrees and 10% chance of rain. Yes, that is correct. So uh, we're going to ask some tough topics today. We're always going to ask tough questions. We don't tell anybody about what the questions are going to be. They're just random questions. So, All right, so my question today for you all is, do they ever have any fights in the, in the public schools and at your school in the Dominican Republic? All, all the right. time. All the time. She they, fight with a girl like one Yeah, they crushed, me. they crushed me here, and I got a pencil and I pulled her. What you She do? hit her with a pencil. Because she's so fat. She's yeah, fat. she's like bigger than her. Exactly. She's and she defend herself. She's fat. Yeah, yeah, she's fat. She fat. Not fat. She's like. It's but, but but who started the fight? Her. She. The girl did. Yeah. You didn't start it. No. Did you guys get in trouble? No, her. She did. The, the girl. The girl, the, the girl, did. girl because did. Because she started. And she'd be yeah. crying. She'd be like, I didn't do nothing. And, and, and the teacher it. said, like, yeah, she didn't do nothing. And I said, like, this is what happened. They be bullying the more little kids. Exactly. They'd be bullying the little kids. And that what happened to but, but you never got into a fight. Not now, like that lady, years ago. Years ago. Yeah. But the lady hit too hard. We fight, me and her, and look what she did in here. Mm -hmm. And there. You hit your sister? Yes. She, she hit me first. first. <laughs> she hit me first. Y'all can't do that. Don't, she don't, don't hit me first. <laughs> you guys yeah. gotta look out for each other. Yeah, but I love you. Yeah. No, I don't love you. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, don't mind my hair. I haven't done my hair. That's Man, so, don't worry you know about John? Mm-hmm. No, el polo chévere es feo. No, el polo chévere es feo. Mira, cree que el polo chévere es feo. You said something about my no, shirt. No, we're saying that you're no, pretty. No, like. we're saying you're pretty. That I like your shirt. Yeah, your yeah. shirt's really pretty. That's a hundred. No, it's feísimo ese polo chévere. Okay, my question is, okay, no, your question is, yeah. what oh, your, your yeah, yes, question? Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Coach Sean, my question is, what make you come to DR? Uh, what made me come to DR? I am disabled in the, in the Dominican, in, well, I'm disabled, so in the United States, uh, I receive a disability check, so I can do that. I can afford to pay for everything that I need to pay for, take care of my children. And DJ, he wants to play baseball, and it's a lot of Dominicans that get drafted in baseball. So that was the reason we moved here. And then I met Brenda here, and I met my baby here, and I just love the Dominican Republic. The people are very nice here. And when I play baseball with the Yankees, I met a lot of Dominican people, and the Dominican people are just very, very nice. Yes, they are. Okay, my question is, why were you thinking to make this? But did, did let you? me start over. Like, well, why, why did why I you make this, the YouTube the channel? YouTube channel? I, yeah, I, why you created a YouTube channel? I created the YouTube channel so I can have something to do because I'm disabled, I don't work anymore. And I like helping children out. All my life, I've always helped. Uh, I've been a humanitarian. I liked, I adopted one child and I fostered about 350 children. So like when kids didn't have any mama or papa or nothing like that, That's I, tough. I, would, uh, I would take them in and when they were abused or burned or something like that. So I really love working with children showing them how to play baseball and uh, just just spending time with children, especially girls. I really like spending time with the girls because a lot of them don't have father figures. And like you all, I know you guys have fathers, but they don't, your, your, your father doesn't live in the house with you. So you need a, a father figure to always show you the right things, how to be respectful, how to respect yourself how to uh, not let men take advantage of you and you know how how to respect yourself and because they have a lot of crazy men out there that like to take advantage of young girls and young women and things like that so 
I just want to show you guys how to respect yourself and uh, how to uh, conduct yourself, you know, because it's it's a lot of prostitution yes. in the Dominican Republic. It's a lot of prostitution in the United States. But you guys, women are very women are very intelligent, and you all are very intelligent. And you guys can be police officers. You can do you can do whatever you want to. You're bilingual, and you don't have to like sell your body or do something crazy to make money. There's a lot of ways to make money, and you just need like. Uh, uh, father figures and, and uh, role models and that's what I like to do and it also helps me out because it keeps me busy I just don't like staying at home just sleeping yeah. and eating and getting fat am I fat? <laughs> no, no you're not fat, fat. Have I, got yeah. Yeah. Yes. I know no you're hey, not fat. fat okay anyway <laughs> uh, so that was that was awesome question so that's did I answer your question? Yes, you did. That was a good question. That was a good question. And did I answer your question? Yes. So anyway, we are happy to be a part of the Dominican route. We're having a lot of fun. And Sunday, don't forget about Sunday, we will video. That's an exciting day. That's an exciting. Independence, I can't wait. Independence Day. And we will video it and uh, show you guys. Thank you. Thank you guys so much for being part of the Dominican route and don't forget to subscribe and turn on those post notifications so you don't miss one of our videos. Turn on the post notification on so you get notified on Sunday. We're going to be there the whole day. We're going to get excited, right? Yeah. Bye guys. Bye guys. Bye.